pull the ante, high low whip, flourish whip, whatever you call this skill, it is one of the most essential skills in anybody's staff spinning or lightsaber practice. So that is what we're gonna learn today. The reason this skill is so great is because there's so much you can do with it. You can create levels, you can use your body, you can make it look combative, change directions, change patterns. So much can happen with this really basic, really simple skill. So we're gonna break this skill down into two parts. We're gonna do the high whip and then we're gonna do the low whip. And I'm gonna teach you with the staff because it's a more neutral tool, so it's gonna be a little bit easier to learn. So we're gonna start with the high whip part of the skill first. Now, I want you to imagine that you're standing on your own personal clock, your feet are six, your head is 12, your left is nine o'clock, your right is three o'clock. So we're gonna start in the right hand and we're gonna point out to that three o'clock position. And all we're gonna do to start is swing our arm clockwise through the clock until we reach noon. Literally nothing else happens. Once we reach noon, that's when we're gonna start adding the wrist roll. So all that is, is I'm gonna let the top end fall towards the outside. Bottom end's gonna pass in front of me. It's gonna do one full circle behind my body. And then I'm gonna re-grip at the top to do one full circle. So you're just gonna do that at this 12 o'clock position. So I'm gonna go three, six, nine, noon, one loop behind my head, then back out to three. Now once you've finished your high whip, you're ready for the low whip. So as you come up and over and you finish at three o'clock from your high whip, you're just gonna continue that motion, but we're just gonna go behind our back this time. So we're gonna go three, six, nine, and I'm just putting the back of my hand on the small of my back. From here, I'm gonna start dragging my knuckles along my waist until I reach this internally rotated chicken wing position. And what I'm looking for is for my staff to become parallel with this front wall. So if you need to turn your hips a little bit to make that happen, totally cool. So you're going three, six, nine, drag, find parallel, and then once you're here, then you're ready to start pushing down, externally rotating back to six, and then you can finish off the skill with a high whip coming up and over around the skill. And once you've got your high whip and your low whip all worked out, then you can put it together into one continuous fluid skill and then try it with a variety of different tools and weapons. It works with absolutely everything. And if you wanna learn more of these essential staff spinning or lightsaber skills, check out my Freestyle Staff Academy. The link is in my bio to learn more skills like